The Mala Fatra is a well-known and valued tourist region in the north of Slovakia. The heart of the region is the village of Tiakova, famous for its wild, unique nature, enjoyed by tourists in summer and skiers in winter. It's also famous for its inhabitants, who made it famous in the world. The most well-known figure is Jura Janosik, who was born in Tiakova. We can meet him even today, here at the gate of the Malafatra National Park and in the museum as the inspiration for several generations of artists. For anyone who's interested in where the legendary highwayman was born and grew up, a short walk is enough. What makes the Malafatra attractive for tourists today? Rocky mountains and gently sloping hills. Gorges created by rapid streams. Beautiful, wild nature. In short, everything a tourist needs. What's the best starting point for a tourist adventure in the Malafatra? It's best to begin with a trip to Dieri. It'll be an exciting trip for the whole family. What's more, it's a unique place, one of the few in the world. Most of the trails, both the easier ones as well as those for more experienced tourists, lead from Tiakova to the top of Rosutets, Klieb, or the highest peak in the Malafatra, Velki Krivane. Although it's more than 1,700 meters ascent, it's an easy trip with breathtaking views, provided that we take a cable car, which will take us half of the way. And in the southern part of Krivanska Fatra, a place which cannot be missed by any of the tourists, the Shutovsky waterfall. The Malafatra does not only offer walking routes, there are also excellent bicycle routes. For families with children, I recommend the route around the Julina Dam. These are easy routes by the bank of the lake. For more experienced cyclists, we have more difficult routes in the mountains of the Malafatra and Kisutska Vojvodina. The route around Lake Jelina is not only for cyclists, it's also a favorite place for rollerbladers. And a scooter, certainly. This means of transport, which seems to be forgotten nowadays, is perfect for romping on the route from Vratna to Tiakova. The Lesser Fatra region is cut by two rivers, the Orava and the Var. Water sports fans can enjoy wooden raft races as well as the more exciting whitewater rafting. And where to stay for the weekend or a longer holiday? In a tourist region like the Malafatra, you'll find accommodation at an affordable price. Travelers can stay at luxury rooms in Jelina or Tiakova. Start hotels do not only offer high standard accommodation, but also excellent cuisine. And obviously, an evening relax in the swimming pool or sauna. Backpackers can stay at traditional hostels and campsites. Additionally, the offer of family guest houses is developing. Here, the atmosphere is created by the hosts. Such holidays will stay in the memory for a long time.